Buying your first home will make you poor if you get it wrong. There are three big mistakes to avoid here. And the third one's the biggest. Number one is not looking at the numbers between buying a property as an investment and your own home. There is a difference here. Normally buying as an investment is better, but it depends on your tax rate and the interest rate. So look at that for you so that you know what the numbers are telling you. Number two is choosing a property based on what you think you can afford or where you want to live. That is not a good investment. This is a total disaster. When you're buying a property to make you money, you need to make sure it's a rock solid investment. Simple as that. That's not always going to be the same as where you wanna live or how much you think you can afford. If it's not, keep tweaking your strategy until you can buy a property that is going to be a good investment. Number three, and this is by far and away the biggest one, is that you should only ever afford to buy your own home when you can afford to pay the mortgage and pay down the mortgage and invest and do enough investing to hit the wealth goals that you've got outside of just paying off the mortgage on your own home. Sounds really simple, but so few people don't think about this that they think about, can I afford the mortgage? Is it going to work? And they don't worry about how much money they have left over for actually building the wealth. It's lovely to have a nice roof over your head, but you don't want that to come at the sacrifice of you hitting the investing and wealth building goals that you need to hit for the future. Property is an area where there's the most opportunity to help you get ahead, but it's also the area that has the most mistakes that people make that sell themselves short. Do not fall into these traps.